Okay, so this is my final video on the Sherpa um, snorkel that I fitted to my car. I uh, just wanted to go through the last things, um, share with everyone that might be thinking to put one of these on, uh, some of the issues that I had. So again, I'll go through quickly. You're gonna have to redo the um, template. Um, so you can see how far out it, it is in some cases. I don't know if they're all like this. I don't know if I've got the wrong template. They assume, they assure me that it's the right template, but uh, that d it definitely wasn't gonna work. If you don't check it, you're gonna run into big problems. And this hole here wasn't even on my template. Um, so, check the template it does say to do that but you really need to check it it's 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 not right at all this is the instructions that they give you with it so if i'm just to go through the instructions quickly it's common for any vehicles to move uh, such side indicators overflow bottles i had to move the overflow bottle that's that's um that's okay um and particularly the template are correct so they do emphasize checking the template but be aware it is nowhere near right it definitely was nowhere near right in my case there's also a thing in here called frequently asked questions um, are the templates accurate well they say and the answer that they've put here is yes they've sold hundreds and I'd beg to differ I, I don't think that this template's accurate at all. It sh fits the shape and the, of the guard very well, and it's a good, gives you a good indication of where to put the snorkel, but definitely wasn't uh, accurate at all. Um, the other question here is the snorkel body and many ducts are rotationally moulded. <coughs> well, that, um, and that's to allow for error. So they're saying use a 16 mil drill bit I didn't want to drill 16 mil drill uh, holes in my guard so I tried to stick to minimal I ended up getting it with 12 mil bits so I think that sort of will 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 be okay um, if you're gonna drill the holes try and get it to 12 mil if you mark out your template uh, accurate enough you should be able to get them with 12 mil they're only about a 6 mil bolt or 8 mil bolt um, the install time, look, it took me well over a day. I did it in broken times, but it was well over a day. Uh, and I had to move the, the, tr the water bottle. Now, on the website, I'm sure it says that ML and MN Triton, uh, ML Triton, you need to move the, the bottle and you need a new bottle. But they didn't say anything about the MN Triton. I read, may have read it wrong, but I'm assuming that that's, that they... I always thought that they that the MN bottle was going to be in the right place, but it wasn't. Um, all the tools required, that's all speaks for itself. Make sure you've got them. Um, removing all the guard, the stuff underneath your car, that's all uh, speaks for itself. It's bugger of a job, but it's it's okay. Um, securely tape the the template in place. It does work. It does. It does go onto the 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 guard, uh, the sorry, the um, yeah, the, the guard, quite well. But it's only you can only use it for a bit of a, a guide. You have to remark the holes. Um, the main intake hole at to ninety five millimeters, which was fine. Um, and just going through here, there's mounting studs, studs and snorkel bracket. This is in the instructions that they give you. Go through here, and I've marked here. Uh, drill the holes to match the diameter of the rivets or screws provided. Make sure you check all them because down a bit further, um, I'll get. I'll explain. <clears throat> I got when I mounted the snorkel. I got to all but one of the bolts. One of the uh, bolts that's in this snorkel. I couldn't literally couldn't put a nut on one of them, which is the last, the highest one up near the door you I, 
I I can't find or I don't know how you would do it. It is literally you can't get your hand in there. The there's a part of a strengthening part in the guard that you would need to um uh move just to even get the nut on. So I just deleted it. It it, it doesn't need it anyway. I didn't want to bother with it. On the air filter adapter, drill out the marked holes to seven millimeters. Whatever you do, don't drill the holes out to seven millimeters because you're only putting uh, like a four mil rivet in there. I don't know why they've put that there, but it's black and white and it's definitely something you don't need to do. Um, you, I drilled the holes five millimeters. They're the ones that go into the intake adapter. It's an aluminum adapter. Uh, I had to drill them five millimeters and back in the past video I had made, they w I had to grind out that adapter so it would fit over the existing air boxes um, spout, I, I guess you'd call it. So that's a little bit of stuff around as well, but definitely don't drill the holes out to seven millimeters. Um, the inner dark guard duct, well look, I had to cut it because it was totally wrong, which I've shown in the, the video. Um, it works out a good in a way because it means I don't have to pull the hole under the clamp that's out near the guard to, if I want to take things out. I can just disconnect it in the middle uh, behind the light. If I have to change a light globe in the headlight, I'm going to have to pull the rubber tube out of the way uh, and this will make it easier. So in a way that worked out better, but it was definitely wasn't going to work from, from the factory. Um, so that's that's basically the the, the stuff on on fitting it. Uh, I've just got some other things. Delivery was okay. It took about three weeks. Um, it was packaged okay and just turned up in bubble wrap. And um, I just undone it all. Just made sure everything was in there. It's just bubble wrapped and taped up. Basically everything was in there. Um, the instruction sheet, the template, and all the fixings. Pretty happy with that. There wasn't. There's only a couple of screws and things left. I think they're just for other, maybe other cars or applications. Um, so problems with the fitment, including the template. Instructions themselves, a bit out of, make sure you read them. The adapter was too small. I don't know if it was to fit the Triton or not. I, I'm not sure. Um, all in all, the quality is quite good. I think it's a good, it's a good unit. Uh, it's strong, it's supposedly it's UV rated um, and it looks good it, it hugs the guard really well um, the the um, stainless steel air ram uh, grate or grill whatever you call it, it it looks good too I think it looks quite quite neat um, better than the plastic ones you see on all the others so that's about it I thought I'd film all this because uh, it did take me a while and I, I don't know hopefully um, you don't run into the same problems I did, this might help. But um, at the end of the day, it looks good. It's going to do the job, but it's definitely a task that you will need to do your homework on. Um, uh, make sure you check over everything on the way through. Thanks a lot.